That's the other side of the vehicle. I need you to come out towards this side. Yeah, you just see a five. Hey, I'm gonna cross in front of you. Back at any moment. Oh my god. Oh, is that a grenade? Who just threw a grenade? Really? <laughs> At least I stopped. <laughs> yeah, at least you did. Norway. Incoming 911. Going down there to take that 911. 911, where's your emergency? Um, it's at the airport at 9 8 in the city. Okay, what seems to be going on? Uh, some guy just hit my car and took off. He just, he just left. He just sideswiped my car and just left. Okay, what did the car look like? It was a silver buffalo. Like okay. one of the first gen buffaloes. And he was wearing like a orange shirt and he had like a a big beard and a and a black fedora. Okay, so he's driving a silver Buffalo, uh, wearing a orange shirt, beard, with black fedora. Okay, would you like to speak to officers? Oh, no, I'm on my way to get on the plane right now. I just parked my car and he hit it and took off, and I'm already late, so I gotta get through security. But, yeah, just, you know, catch him and, and give him, just call me back for his insurance. Yeah, no problem. Uh, do you also happen to catch a plate as well? No, he, he left too fast. All right, no issue. We'll be on the lookout. Thank you so much. Okay, I appreciate it. Yep. Okay, I'll put that in. New dispatch. 9A New Empire Way. Kind of what's out that uh, I was driving today. Uh, yeah. Uh, attention units, be on the lookout. We had a 911 call come in for a hit and run. The vehicle was a silver buffalo. Driver was wearing a orange shirt and beard with black fedora. That was a silver. Ten nine. Do we have a last known uh, direction? Yes, that's going to be at Postal 98, uh, was last known location. Uh, at the airport. That was a silver buffalo wearing orange shirt and a beard with a black fedora. Okay, there we go. You want to put in a marker for a general direction? Yeah. I'm already down in the area. I'll keep an eye out, but haven't seen anything uh, leave this way. It's gonna be postal one zero one Olympic Freeway under underneath the Olympic Freeway on uh also Street. Oh snap! I have a right unit in the truck in front of me as well. Two units. Do you need Would you like back up? Uh, negative time. Alright, go ahead. Metro 322, do we have a description of the vehicle that was involved with that hit and run? Uh, on the uh, RP side? The Silver Buffalo was the one that uh, hit the driver. 10 4, do you have a description of the vehicle that it hit? Negative. The uh, caller left the state on an airplane. Uh, 
Stand by on that. I'm gonna be uh, checking right now. Yeah, I am gonna be with the individual, but it doesn't match. Ten four. Three forty-three. This guy matches. Uh, that's lost. Oh boy. Uh, is he wearing orange shirt and black fedora? Or he may be our individual that matches close to the description. So you need another person on scene. Four or five, do you need an additional? I. We can have some more out towards the uh, Arancho Boulevard area. I lost eyes. I didn't have any PC to initiate. Um, he was last known north on Arancho Boulevard and. Uh, so more towards there. So if he's heading north, hmm. He's going towards Mirror Park. If he doesn't, you know, turn. Of course. Four, three, nine, four. Four or five, just your 43, and the one I had eyes on did not have any damage on it. Um, so I had nothing on him. 10 four. the uh, caller had a plate. Yeah, that would be helpful. Yeah. yeah, but he told me no. Didn't get it. And he had to go for his plane. So, uh, yeah, I guess it must have just happened right in that parking lot back there. Then. Yeah, that's my shirt. Yeah. Uh, Metro 322, be advised, I have, uh, Multiple shots fired in the vicinity of my traffic stop here, uh, between 394 and 101. So there? Uh, clear the automatic gunfire, unknown direction. Means by that, I do believe you're close to the ammunition. Where they do practices. Oh, that is where they're close to. Uh, oh, okay, step one. I think it's just nothing. I don't know, I'm just fun. putting markers on the map. No, it's perfect. Yeah. Um. I don't know, I have a. F I would think if they're heading north, if I was them, I had to Mirror Park, but who knows. always uh check it out yeah i don't know if there's any units up there but you can check there is no units up there mm. they're all in this okay. general area Yeah, we got a lot around us. Okay. That makes sense. Trying to canvas.
Nice. You caused that. Uh -huh. How? How? Okay. Real mm -hmm. professional. Say hello. Yeah, what's up? You know, keep the streak clean. Yep. With your broken glass. Is it a rail leather any ticket? I mean, well, it, I'm a little busy, so you, I think that. Oh, whoa. Sir. Okay. It, we're, we're trying to we're talk, just... sir. Sir, you can't just. Go ahead. Split. Yeah. Uh, just. Uh, rude. Be okay. Alright. Uh, be safe. Had no damage to their vehicle. No one, no more. They did say that they were giving away a uh, free suburban shirt at the Maze Bank Arena today, so... Oh. I have that much... Metro 4 and 5, the uh, tequila on this clear is nobody inside. A uh, guy must have walked out the front on foot. Give me that description of white male, yellow suburban t-shirt, uh, wearing a fedora, black sunglasses, and uh, with a black beard. Okay. Fast enough that I didn't catch them? Four or five yeah. Yeah. At this point, of course, uh, it would be long advised, gone. They were in a gray buffalo, correct? Or yeah, buffalo? It's, it's parked behind the business, abandoned. Uh, the guy, I watched the guy go out, get out, and go into the tequila laws. My guess is he might have seen me and uh, just cut straight through and walked out the front while I was looking for damage on the car. I wonder okay, if he may have been in a vehicle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he had a beard. Alright, 10 4. Be advised, the individual that I stopped earlier was a Carl Johnson, did not have a beard. Or he did not have a beard. Also driving a silver and colored buffalo. I got a buffalo that just pulled out front as well. Simple. Was it just occupied times one or times two? He's walking towards the tequila law now. That's clear. If you want to uh, just uh, stay out of sight of, the, of uh, anybody maybe in the front of swap or something. Hey, from, he just went inside. No, I'm going to sit every on this time. car around back. Every time. Hey, from. Actually, sorry, who was the other unit that uh, went for the tequila law? Saw the other buffalo? That'd be 285. Sorry about that. 285. Um, can you confirm the license plate on that one? Hmm. Not currently. I'm keeping eyes to see if our subjects walk back out. Or if uh, the guy that went in, actually, there's another one getting in this one out front. I'm going to initiate on the one that came from around back. Be advised, 285. I've seen him. I don't know if we should take a right here or if we should come up around. I believe he had a black beard. It was a orange shirt, beard, and a black fedora is what they describe the end of a driver as. Directly at 689. 
Bank South Mill Mountain Drive. Okay, there's a third that one. Closing. Oh, there he is. Is that him? I think so. Southbound Milton Drive. They're switching cars. He's, he's, he's or he stole the, car. the, other the other car. Yep, he switched cars. Okay, okay well, somebody cluster. stay with this one, right? Yeah. Four five, I, I got him. He uh, made a left here. Um. Lost right, eyes. Well. Yeah, cause I don't know where they are at yeah, this point. Four five, I got him in. He's uh, headed westbound on Greenwich Way. Six seven three, making hey, a sir. right turn northbound Madwing Thunder what is, Drive, heading into why the did, Why did I just watch myself get out of my car and take my not car? That was Wrong. my car. What westbound is happening? Madwing Thunder Drive eight sixty. Uh, well, we are trying to heading, figure that very uh, thing out. Why is that guy stealing my identity? Sir, it's been one of those nights. What is that, that guy? Looked just like he said. Well, his name was Carl Maybe Johnson. That's my seven. name. Okay, never That's, met him. Yes. No. So, so I mean, um, I've I met was, myself in the yeah. mirror. Is there any reason why he would say that you, that he was on your traffic stop? Do you know that individual? So Wait, what? We're he, up to no, I don't. I think he's we'll trying to steal right. my identity. Okay, Normandy because I Drive, went up to him and I went to talk to him and he said that, he's like, yeah, yeah, I was the one that you had pulled over earlier. What? Yes, sir. Yeah, he's like, he's like, yeah, okay. you, you, you had me pulled you over earlier and I, and I asked Drive. him where, uh, or my other officer asked him where uh, I had you pulled five. over at. You pulled over at. Right. And he's like, uh, oh, yeah, you know, I forgot and this and that. Well, I mean, I could tell you where you stopped me. Okay, where did, where did I stop you at? You, you stopped me Left right on there on, Indian um, East. it was on uh, Power Street at, like, Adam's Apple underneath the, uh, Olympic Freeway. Five okay. Okay, alright, well then that Indian checks out. Still. Um, now the second question is, is that, how did you end up in his vehicle? Well, I went to the Tequila to Law, like I said, like I told right you, because I thought it was, you know, wear south, a suburban south, shirt, get a free pair of shorts north. day. And uh, nobody was there. It was dark, and I got all turned around. I walked out, and I must have walked out of the back instead of the front. And I saw my car sitting there, and I was like, "Oh, I, I, I guess I parked it here." And I got in, and my key worked. Okay, were uh, were the keys in it, or? Uh, well, I mean, like it was this. It was running. Okay, so it was running. Yeah. So like, I was like, oh. Yeah, I, I, I just I thought I had a brain fart and I just ran in real quick trying to get these shorts for free and I I don't know what happened. Do you typically okay. carry two sets of keys with you? No, not usually, but I do have a habit of leaving my keys in the cup holder. Ah, oh, okay. so, so the car running, I was like, uh, I mean, you know, it's happened. So let me ask you this, uh, Mr. Johnson. You said you came yep. out of the back of the tequila la? Yes. Okay, so you do realize if you come out of the back of the tequila la, right? You you have to go down a set of stairs in order right. to get to that to that back parking lot. Yeah. And then you happen to jump in the vehicle in in the vehicle that was back there. How did you not put two and two together that you didn't go down or sorry, didn't go up a set of stairs whenever you parked your vehicle in the front? Well, I I don't know. I just I thought I, I got turned around in there and I saw a door and it went outside and when I went out and I saw my car there or what I thought was my car and I went wait didn't I wait I, I don't think I parked it there and it was running and I was like I don't know maybe valet service or something okay valet service okay. at a bar I I don't know I just I saw a car that looked exactly like mine and I just I got in it and it was on and I you know I don't know do you okay. currently have all of your other typical possessions, like with your wallet? Are you missing any cards, anything like that? Yeah, no, I have my wallet and everything. Okay. Have you had um, a mix-up with your car before? Have I what? Have you had a mix-up with your car before? Um, what do you mean? Like, have I gotten into a car that looks like, exactly like mine before? Yes, or have you had anyone well, break into yours recently? 
Not that I'm aware of, no. But I've also never seen a guy that looked exactly like me get out of a car that was exactly like mine, or I guess get out of my car and then get into his that was exactly like mine before. Right. Yeah, just trying to establish if maybe you'd lost a wallet recently and maybe that's how he had gotten your information. Or do you know of anyone yeah, that might want to try to hurt you or world, follow yeah. you or anything like that? No, but I do tend to put my information into every single website that I visit. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's okay. a... Yeah, sometimes they have good deals where it's like, put your information in and you get to get a free, you know, like, uh, Life Invader jacket. And I'm like, I want that. Okay. I'm really into getting free clothes. I see that. So, you know, if I see a pop-up on my, my computer and it's like, please insert your uh, social security number to get these, uh, you know, oh. E. cola socks, I'm like, that, you know, what's the harm? And you don't have, like, identifier shield set up, you know, to stop that happening? What is that? Oh, it's where it alerts you when someone tries to steal your identity and become you. Oh. Isn't that life no. or something? Yeah, I'm Something like old. that. I'm not that old. Ah. Uh, uh, do you have your driver's license with you by chance? Um, I gave it to that cop and then he left. Oh. Okay. Yeah, so the one in that Caprice, he just, he stole my identity. Wait, he stole my identity. Um, uh, well, I mean, well, he might have just, that's how it happens. He might have got it in a rush, you know. The, we'll, uh, I'll contact him and see if maybe he can bring back your uh, ID for you. Okay? okay, but yeah, I mean, my name's Carl Johnson. Okay. I mean, to be fair on his side, I have gotten into my own Ron vehicle a couple of times. That, cause you know, looked familiar. Yeah, I mean, like I can't, I, I couldn't even tell the difference. Oh uh, yeah, they look very similar. Like, uh, like something with a Q, like LQ, KQ, or something. Mm -hmm. But they told me that that other one, that that guy that looked just like me, showed up, wasn't mine, cause it was like IMG or something. Okay. I don't know. All I know is I was just trying to get some free clothes, and then all of a sudden a guy that looks just like me Hello? just oh, took up, his bro? car that looks just like mine. Well, I was trying to get some free clothes, too, but somebody uh, forgot to fail to mention that you had to have, have a fedora. Yeah, no, it's, yeah, I forgot about the fedora thing. I was, I was, I'm not going to lie. I was kind of upset about that. Well, sir, uh, we have the officer who had you originally pulled over. He's going to come over here and uh, return your ID, D ID to you real quick, okay? Okay, yeah, that's no problem. All right. Okay, this is the other gentleman's vehicle? No, I think uh, that's this mine. This is actually going to be uh, his different. vehicle. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think? I don't know anymore. So, I had your I had your plate locked still on my radar from the original. Uh, this one's and, uh, KJQ, so I guess this is his. But he isn't sure? I mean, we can double check the yeah. registration. Yeah. If it's in here. Uh, I guess the yeah. In um, yeah. And we can um, double check the registration if you don't mind either pulling it out or we can go ahead and look for that. Yeah, I mean, yeah, you can, you can, you can check it. County one one zero ten thirty seven ten eight. Alrighty. Apologize about uh, running away from you, sir. But uh, oh no, it's all right. It's I was your, uh, you trying to get out of your way, and then all of a sudden you you left. I was like, wait. Yeah, yeah I uh, yeah. These uh, those other officers were having some difficulty turning around. I was guessing, so I was like, yeah, might as well help them out. But uh, here's your driver's license back. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. Alrighty. Yeah. Um, in case y'all in here it just seems like he got his vehicle mixed up with uh, the other one and uh okay the um, other guy came back after running from uh 285 and uh 322 up over there and went and got his car back and then uh took off uh the other guy okay. was the one we were looking for with the beard that uh, we got the description for for the hit and run so yeah so that 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 guy's wanted, not me. 
Correct, yeah. Well, and the weird thing is his plate is registered to a Johnson Carl, I think I told you. Yeah, no, that's what you were saying. Yeah, the guy... Yeah, I think this guy is, like, he stole my identity, and then he's trying to, like, reverse identity theft me. That's what it seems like, because he's, uh, he also gave your name as well. Um, what? Didn't have an ID, but he gave your name. Yeah, no, that guy's definitely doing some shady stuff. Seems I'm like not gonna it. lie, his beard looked kind of fake. Yeah, maybe it was. Well, I mean, I it's, mean, everything about him seems fake at this point. The yeah, registration so... on this vehicle is for Carl Johnson, so, I mean, you can be okay. a little more rest assured that this is actually your vehicle. Yeah, no, I think, I think, th I'm pretty sure that one's mine. Yeah, that was the plate you were mentioning earlier. I'm going to yeah. uh, see what I can get on the registration, because I still have it locked, and see if I can find uh, any info on the owner of the other vehicle, though. Okay. Uh, Tex, you mind if I uh, talk to you over here? Yeah, sure. Well, I believe I heard he has your, your license that he gave back. Yeah, he gave me my license back. Okay. That's good. Oh, I just got it. Oh. Oh. A promotion for free dishwasher underwear. Okay. Sir, do not put your information into that. Well, it just look. It says free. Okay, it, I get it. It says it'll be here tomorrow. Stand free it's is a simple information. It's not, sir. You, First name, you have... last name, date of birth. Yep, easy. Yep, home address. Sir. Uh huh. Do not be oh. filling that out. Routing number. Hmm. Okay. Oh, no, that's, that's your direct. Banking information, sir. Sir, yeah. no. You checking, checking account number? Yeah, let me just That's... put that in real quick. Yeah, yeah this sir. Is how people get your information that can then be used against you to steal your yeah. identity. Yeah, but it's free piss washer underwear. How else I am well, I supposed to get that? It's it kind of like how you were looking for the shirts and all these other free things. You know, it's very easy and to get same. your information. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> I'm okay. Those. Well, sir. I hope you do actually get that product, but I would recommend that you go ahead and then lock your, your bank down. Yeah, I highly recommend that. Wow. Um, because so part you, of the already giveaway. Have, you already have someone trying to, or actively stealing your identity, so it's not great yeah, to no, go that's... ahead and continue to put your information out there. Well, yeah, but I mean, like, it's free. Yeah, but you're eventually going to have, like, 20 of you running out there, all of you with your identity. Also, do I know who knows what? Wanted, do later on this could really affect your credit if they take out credit cards in your name loans get into accidents it could really mess you up with the cops they do something and they're giving your information it's it could really trip you up in the future uh hey mr johnson um yep. so what i'm what i'm gonna do man is uh normally because this vehicle was involved in a 10 what we call 1031 it's a vehicle pursuit uh um, okay normally we what we would do is we would uh, you know, have have tow come out here and impound it, and you know, run it through evidence and everything like that. I'm not gonna do that, man. You've been pretty cool with me. Uh, what I am gonna do is I'm just gonna do a quick search of the vehicle, make sure that the suspect didn't drop anything in there, like no weapons or drugs or anything like that. Okay. I'm gonna take a couple of quick pictures, real quick, just so that way, you know, for our evidence sake. And then uh, I'm gonna get you on your way here pretty soon. That's uh, yeah. Cool with these other officers, um. Maybe, do y'all have anything like a fingerprint, uh, like a duster or anything like that? I mean, they got the basic kit in the, in the trunk. Yeah, maybe if we could do like a quick fingerprint, you know, uh, maybe see if we can't get any fingerprints off of like the steering wheel or the door or something. Well, yeah, we can see if there's like... anything from the other person. Yeah. He wasn't wearing gloves? Uh, no, he wasn't wearing gloves. Okay. So uh, yeah, if y'all wanted to get on that, I'll just I'm just gonna do a quick search of it and then I'm gonna uh, take some pictures as well. Sound cool with you, Mr. Johnson? What? Is that is that cool? We're just uh we're just gonna do we're gonna do a quick search. We're gonna get a couple fingerprints. See if we we'll see if we can't get any fingerprints off the car. And okay. Then, uh, we'll get it released. You okay? Yeah, that's no problem. Cool. Sounds good. From the, the wheel, maybe on the shifter. 
Yeah. Also, other than this, how's your day been? Uh, it's been pretty good. I, I, yeah. I'm disappointed I missed the, the tequila law, wear a suburban shirt, get shorts promo. Oh, I see. That's what, uh, dragged you to oh, tequila's first, sir. Oh, a P and Q, P's and sir. Q's hat? No. What? Oh, it's a whole hat. Sir, eventually you're Mother's gonna have- Mother's maiden name. Okay, yeah. let me just put that in. Sir, you- First family pet, yep. Yep. No. Elementary school. Okay. Let me just put put that in. <sighs> Savings account. Yep. Got it. Rally number. Let me just. I already copied that. Yeah. Let me just paste that. Yeah. Sir. Social the, security. Yeah. Eventually, you're not going to be and, just Carl yep, Johnson and anymore. And send. Okay. So I'm getting that hat. Yeah, and I hope you enjoy having 30 people be Carl Johnson, who was going to get you into loads of trouble. Oh, and probably steal your money out of your bank. You might want to lock that down. What? How could they get into my bank? You gave them their your you gave them your number. Yeah, but like that's just a that's just like a number yeah, thing that they give you. No, that's that's like you can't you can't do oh, anything with that. Yeah. Oh, you can. That's only oh, really? halfway halfway to. Oh, it's one of the. Oh, weird. I said sir. sign into my bank. No. To get the, oh, well, I guess. All right. No, I sir. Just oh, sir. Yep. Dude, don't. Yep. Password hey. to my bank. Let me just no, go that... ahead and send. Oh. Yep. Definitely well. getting that hat now. Yeah. You can. I, yeah, I hope... said I entered the final round. And I, you know, I just need to provide that information. Uh -huh. I'm going to win. Yeah. Uh, hopefully you didn't have a lot of money in that bank account. Uh, no, no. I mean, you know, it was, it was okay. Cause it's uh their bank account now. Well, how would, how would they do that? Uh, cause yeah, now they have your bank have information completely of it, and they're gonna end up going in and changing everything to the their Carl Johnson for life. And then you're gonna become unknown and fade into obscurity, and be no longer Carl Johnson, cause that it'll be them only. Well, but they can't. I'm Carl Johnson. Uh, yeah, not anymore if you keep providing all that information. Yeah, but like, they can't make me not be Carl Johnson. Mm -hmm. They can definitely Does give it a like, really good shot. Exist? Uh, well, people are not going to believe you're Carl Johnson. Yeah, but I am. Uh, yeah, but if you keep giving them all of this information, eventually they'll just be the only Carl Johnson. And with your money. I'm gonna clear off here then and uh, keep Well, I, I, I don't see how they would, they could do that. Uh, you know, normally they really couldn't, but you're really giving them everything they need. Actually, I can show you right here in this book. See this? It's a stealing identities for dummies book. Oh. So it actually tells well, that's you. That's not mine. Right, but it lists for someone who wants to steal identities. Oh, I just got a text exactly message. Exactly how they. Okay. And what are they oh, asking for this? Uh, hi, Mr. Johnson. This is Sandra from Fliga Bank. Thank you for withdrawing your entire life savings. Oh, appreciate oh. your business. Yeah. That's not good. Oh. Huh. You uh, you might want to call the Fliga Bank and uh. Well, the thing up. is, do I do I get anything for it? Do I get a free Fliga Bank tie? That'd be cool. Um, you might want to talk with the manager. There, the manager of the Fleet of Bank, Mr. Mono Plyman. He might be able to help you out. Uh, uh, Mr. What? Mr. Mono Plyman. He's the manager of the Fleet of Bank. Real nice guy. He has uh, one of those okay. uh, spectacle things. You know, the little one-eye glasses. Okay. What's his social security number? Oh, oh well. That's not typically common number. information, sir. Yeah. Do oh. you give your social security to people? Yep. Yes, well, he does. I got do another that? text message. Yeah, he's given everything over. Eventually, he's no longer going to be Carl alert. Johnson over you anymore. You just purchased 400 iFruit phones. Oh, sick. Sir, you didn't, though, did you? Not that I remember, but that's going to be cool. You're not going to get that. Hey. I don't think that's yeah. going to your address. You might want... Actually, you know what? Do you mind if I see that? That purchase order? What? Just this text message that says that I 
purchased it? Oh, it's just a text message. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just it a, yeah, Amazon it's just a app. it's just a Mamazon. No, it's just a text I mean, that says my purchase went through with my 400 iFruit phones that I must have ordered at some point. Yeah, no, but he's gonna get home. Ordering them. No. Mm, I mean, a what happy would be surprise. The reason, well, what would be the reason for purchasing 400 iFruit phones? Mm, I. Uh, to have, it seems I guess, like I don't you're know. really trying to you like to get things for free, correct? Get them in bulk. Oh, another one. He's gonna go home, and on the window my, is gonna be oh. someone that looks like him. They're gonna close the window, and they've already changed uh, the locks. My ED and pills have been delivered to my front door. Mm. Did you order those? For some Wait, reason, no, it says no. this one is for real. This is not fraudulent. Why is that specified? Well. Your business um for future i mean obviously we can't force you to do anything but highly recommend you're not giving out your personal information to yeah. people this is a, the exact reason as to why you know they're stealing your identity they're really it can ruin your life you know take out a bunch of loans all the well, I don't, steps, I, it car. sounds like things are working out pretty good i just got this shirt i'm about to get 400 ifru phones i don't think you are though if you didn't you're not. actually order them you know, they have all your banking information. Someone just took out your life savings. That's all your money. Yeah, but like, it says right here, 400 iFruit phones. You realize that people can lie to you, correct? Well, yeah, of course. And so, does that not cross your mind when you come across these messages saying that, hey, you've gotten this or you've done this when you actually haven't? Oh, another one. Uh, this is your mom, uh, just give you inheritance in the form of iFruit music gift cards if you- Oh. Sweet. I'm getting an inheritance of iFruit music gift cards. That's definitely not how inheritance- That's wonder... not- They're still alive? Yeah. Sir, I I'm serious, you're gonna go home, your doors are gonna be locked, and this you're person's gonna be nothing. overtaking your life. Yeah, but I'm Carl Johnson. Yeah, they're going to be Carl so, now. Well, Mr. Johnson, one thing, um, so first things first, we've done an inventory of the car and you're good to go uh, as soon as we're clear. Oh, another one. These two other officers are done with you. Um, but I would highly recommend How that long you, will I be in uh, Somalia? you get like the life flare or something or whatever that app is. That, uh, well, I'm not, I'm, your identity. my hips are fine. Um, and second of hey, all, how long, um, do, you, do you know how long I'll be in Somalia for? Uh, Were you sir? planning on going to Somalia? Uh, no. Well, then I don't think it would be zero, correct? Oh, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. Well, uh, sir, you're good to go on my end. We're gonna go look for that uh, individual that that stole your identity, and uh, I hope okay, you have sweet. a better day. Yeah, I'm gonna go okay. wait for my eye fruit phones to get delivered. Alrighty, well, and I'm gonna check out this ED that. medication that was delivered to my front door. Uh, Have fun with day. that. Yeah, I hope I, that works out. Yeah. I'm so excited. Oh, what a God. weird character. I don't want to say that he's stupid, but that was really stupid. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? I got a question. Is it not? Is it not life alert? Life uh, alert is the button yeah. for old people. It is. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah. Well, it probably wouldn't hurt if he got that too. You never know. You can never be too careful nowadays. All right. See you later. See ya. Metro three twenty two. I'm gonna be ninety eight eight from fifteen. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure he's getting home, and the Carl Johnson, the other one's just gonna be in his home. Oh. And yeah. Yeah. And just the door locks could be changed and all. And then it'll just he won't be Carl Johnson anymore. Oh, his life is <laughs> ruined. 100%. Oh yeah, it is. I tried to get him to stop, but he gave him the, everything, bank login, all of it. Well, how do you make it this this far in life and not know to not give out? your social security number to just yeah. anybody i'm not or sure to, you know like i understand like you kind of forget things or maybe you uh, 
order something and kind of forget about it because it takes a while to get there, but 400 iFruit Pump? Yeah, I don't think you I forget that. You can't tell me you would completely forget that. Also, why would you no. order that in the first place? Yeah. There's no way someone is that forgetful unless they're having, like, blackouts. Yeah, no. Poor guy, though. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, it's... Hey. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, I told him, like, it he's not gonna uh... become Carl Johnson anymore, so... No. Well, at least he'll get his, uh... Yeah. ED <laughs> Since apparently that one was real. Yeah. Weird. <laughs>